Hi there and welcome to another Room 3428. I'm Kim and you're disappointed because I'm not Lisa with more fantastic footage of her and Josh being goofed together. Lisa had some computer problems um, so I am vlogging today for her because I was uh, mentally handicapped and completely forgot that Tuesday was even Tuesday um, and missed my vlog day so she was nice enough to let me come on to her day so here I am. And she'll be back on soon and putting up some of her uh, footage of her and Josh being goofballs together. Um, right now you're probably admiring my beautiful hairdo and my complete lack of makeup. It's only the best for you guys. Only the best. Um, I have to go and get a haircut. So I'm getting a haircut tomorrow. I'm going to dye my hair for the first time since before I had Wesley. So like three years ago. Um... And I don't know what I'm going to do. Um, so it should be nice and different by the next time you see it. I'll have dye and shorter and blah. But yeah, right now it looks pretty awesome. Lizzie, my love, please feel free to steal the idea of the adventure wall. We have had a lot of fun with it. We kind of have to start rotating some of them out. I don't even have a picture of Lorelei up there yet. Um, and maybe a newer one of my niece and my nephew and stuff like that. But some of them are permanent fixtures. I have to show you my favorite one. So about eight years ago now, eight, nine years ago, oof, I'm old, um, I was on a dragon boat team and that's actually how I met my husband. Um, and our dragon boat coach also knew how to do fire spinning where you have the two long um, kind of steel cables with like fireballs on the end and you spin them and do all kinds of tricks. So we kind of did that at parties. Honestly, we get kind of drunk and then do it. Probably not the best idea. One of our friends caught on fire once. It's a good story. Remind me to tell it to you. Okay, so this is a picture of me doing my fire spinning, and I think it's one of the coolest pictures ever. So that's me, spinning fire, looking all amazing. I like how the fire is all blurred, and I'm kind of holding still, and you can't really see me, but you just see them moving around me. Anyway, yeah, it's a great idea to have them up there. It's nice to look at. It's nice to remember all the cool places we've been and things like that. Um, so yeah, steal away, my love. Super proud of you for your internship in New York. That's going to be amazing. I am super, super jealous that you get to do that and so proud of you. You're going to have a great time. They're going to be so impressed with you. You're going to learn so much. I'm just so excited for you. You'll have to do, uh, send us something, like do things from around New York when you're there. You asked where somewhere we always wanted to go. Um, well, one place I really want to go right now is Bora Bora. We had uh, talked about maybe taking a family trip to Hawaii, because I've been to Hawaii a few times. My husband has never been. But we saw Bora Bora, like a special on Bora Bora the other day, and we really want to go there. So maybe at some point all of us will truck on over to Bora Bora together and uh, have a good vacation. But yeah, that's where I want to go. Which reminds me, I never answered my own question, which was one of our favorite childhood memories. Um, mine, of course, was the standby Disney World, Disneyland thing. Mine was, I went to Disneyland. Um, it, the actual Disneyland part was the best, I was 10, uh, was the best part of the whole trip. But it was me and my parents and my grandparents in a car and we drove there and back. Um, and that, if you drove straight there, would take you about three days from where I live. Um, but I, notice how I was the only child in all of that. So I got to sit in the middle of the back seat all the way down there and all the way back again where my grandfather insisted stopping at ridiculous places and my mom and blah blah and everybody wanted to do these boring things and I had to go because I was the only kid. Really Disneyland was the only part for me but it was awesome. I can't wait to take my kids there. Josh, I'm glad that you're get, you got to California safely. Well, now you have gotten to California safely and that you had a good time driving out there with your friend Colin. P.S. Colin looks mm, pretty much exactly like a boyfriend I had in high school. I briefly tried to figure out how the hell you knew him and then realized it wasn't him. Creepy. Anyway, you guys, I'll leave it here. Um, I'm not going to ask a question. I'll let Lisa ask a question whenever she gets it up or whoever's next ask a question to keep it rolling. Um, I'm going to go and drink some tea before both of my children wake up. They're both sleeping right now. And uh, enjoy the sunshine. It's a super nice day here today. Anyway, I love you guys. I miss you guys. I wish you were here. Talk to you soon. Bye.